hello guys welcome to my youtube channel this is the first time you're coming across this channel i mean please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the like button share this video invite your friends so they will come and join us welcome once again to the amen today is story time the story that happened in Africa of a newly wedded couple just got married they were married on the day of the wedding the worst happened no one pray to to get um, what situation in marriage no one is aiming to receive bad situation in marriage but life happens so this guy and this girl have been dating for a very long time they loved each other and they decided to work get married if I proceed further I would just sound one and two the the younger ones the teenagers out there if you cannot put up with a man's behavior during courtship you cannot put up a man's behavior during dating please do not proceed to marriage if you cannot tolerate that character of the man or of the woman that you are seeing because you or she's not going to change you or she's not going to change nobody changes nobody there's a saying uh, there's a Bible that says a fish that is dried a dried fish when you want to straighten such fish it breaks for two persons to come together to decide that they want to go into marriage they are adults indeed so you can't break anyone you can't threaten anyone to say you can't indeed adjust or present the other person to be the way you want it to be it's, it's going to be difficult so that aside, so they proceeded that they want to get married, they did a, we a traditional wedding, they did a wedding date, everything went out to par, everything was great, there was joy all over the places. It was a thing of joy for both parents, for friends and relatives and loved ones. The wedding was successful. The couple normally is a tradition when you marry. That very day, you proceed to your husband's family house to be welcomed into the family. So they did that at the end of the day, at the end of the gadu. They did that. They proceeded to the family house. Where she was welcome, where she was accepted, where she was introduced or oh, welcome indeed into the entire family. Because when you marry, you don't only marry the man only. You marry the father, the mother, the brother, the sister, the uncle, the relative, all of the family. You marry them. So when you marry, they will all come into your home in one time or the other. They will visit, and it is good for them to visit because when you start having kids, these kids need to know the husband's family. These kids need to know the wife family, so that they can build what a stronger family in the future. Because your family that you're about to start is an extension of the family that is existed before. 
you know that's why the, the Bible, uh, God says go into the world and multiply so when you get married you, you are taken to the family house of the man where you'll be welcome or shut in formally so they did that this couple did that brought the girl in or shut her in uh, fully um, you know it's a wedding day your place is full it's crowded so they decided to what um take a show out spend their only moon in a very quiet and calm place for both of them for both of them only so um they went and they went to uh, book for an hotel uh, they got the one they actually like and the one they can afford They've spent a lot, the real life I've started. So you must be wise to spend it during your wedding or planning your wedding. So they got this hotel room and they paid for it. You know, it's been a long day. They exercise their body so well to need some shower and nice time for both of them. So why they were trying to kind of settle down, take their bath, you know, the man said, hey honey, excuse me, can I get something downstairs? Well, I said, sure, why she goes into the bathroom to kind of refresh herself. So she did uh, refresh herself. And, uh, ready for her husband the first time together you know a memorable work for that matter she waited and waited and waited and uh, the man did not show up it took a longer time so she tried to come out of her room to 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 receptionist so she walked out to the session test and um to kind of ask, please, um, this, did you see any man or my husband walk by this way? So before she could say that, um, the receptionist also saw them or was uh, booked, where they booked the room. So uh, congratulated her once again and, um, um, you know, I appreciate her for the steps she has taken. But... She said something that struck her, and this is it. She said she's too beautiful to suffer in this relationship that she just signed in. So strange, right? The girl could not really um, absorb that. Yeah, the obsession is one for that to kind of emphasize more that she's too beautiful to to get tortured in this kind of relationship so she well the wife tried to find out what she's trying to say because she's not getting it so uh, she not, the receptionist now said um, the man who called her husband is in another room so she mentioned the room to the wife that she should go there and knock as a waiter that the man will um, open the door. So the wife actually went forward to the room number the told her to knock. So when she got there, she knocked and um, indeed the husband opened. The husband responded first, so she was able to recognize that indeed the husband is there. So um, she went in and um, she heard the husband's voice and the man opened the deed and was shocked to see the wife. So the wife went straight into the room and you get what she saw. You don't want to hear this. She saw a younger sister sleeping with her husband 
it was revealed that they were sleeping even before they got married. On her first honeymoon, the man invited the younger sister to the same hotel that they booked a booked extra room for the girl, for the guest, for the wife, the younger sister. Um, didn't sleep with the woman first. He went straight to the younger sister to sleep there. What do you think about this story? If you were in this show, what would you do? Put a comment there and um, let let us know. Just got married. The day of her wedding was the last day of the wedding. Put a comment there that session. Will you accept the man back? Will you start the relationship with torture? Will you end the relationship? Will you end the marriage? We would like to know what you think if you find yourself in such situation. It's a very um, pathetic one. Once again, if you're just coming across this channel, please subscribe to this channel. The main hit the notification bell in order to see more of my videos and when you do that the Lord will surely bless you when you do that whatsoever you will be aiming for you'll be asking for you'll be hoping for for this year 2019 we never pass you by by the blood of Jesus Christ whatsoever dream you dream in 2019 that has not yet come at this day, 26th of December 2019, for the remaining days of this year, it will come and surely be. The Lord will visit you, the Lord will visit you, the Lord will grant you your heart's desire for good. In the mighty name of Jesus. As the year rose by, you watching me up there, but never rose by the year, rose by with the year. As we celebrate this season of joy, peace, and, and hope. So shall be your portion in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yes, this is a channel where we encourage families to stay together. For the family that prays together, stays together. The family that stays together becomes stronger. The family that stays together are overcomers. So, join us. Subscribe to this channel. Hit the notification bell. You have to see my videos when I post this. Upload more. Before I go, I will ask how's your Christmas? Hope you have a nice one. I did. I did with my family. It was lovely. I will glorify God for such um, celebration. Indeed, Christ came, was born like a baby, died for us, for you, that you might live. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. I'll see you again on my next video at this junction. I say have a great day. You may be blessed.